So this is my uh, shelves full of the things I can drink. Uh, it's all of this stuff. There's a couple things I don't want to drink, like uh, that there. It's one of the original Crystal Skull Vodka Skulls. They're like 90 to 120 bucks, so plus I'm not fucking, Steve will do it, so I'm not drinking that. And these, these are one of my favorite things ever. Uh, this is Night Train Express. They stopped making it. It's my favorite alcoholic drink. It's, um, I think 17.5% if I'm not wrong. It's been made since like the 50s. It's the cousin to Thunderbird, which they also stopped making. It's made by Ian J. Gallo. Uh, I have probably the last five bottles of that in existence that I know of. Uh, it's extremely hard to get because they discontinued it two years ago because a bunch of homeless people were drinking it and falling down in traffic and getting hit and stupid shit like that. Point is, it's my favorite alcoholic drink ever. Uh, I have some other stuff in here, old chocolates, stuff like that. Um, I don't know, if there's anything you see on these shelves that you think it'd be neat for me to drink, other than the two aforementioned things, such as like that stuff over there, let me know. And uh, comment it down below and I'll drink it in one of my future videos. So I'm actually just going to shoot a video in here tonight, uh, but I'll show you some more of the other stuff. I know I started with the other thing. Uh, at the end of my video, there's going to be a thing. T the other day in town, a car burst into flames and a cop yelled at me, and I yelled at him. It's it's pretty amusing. But uh, some of the other weird stuff I've got in here is, uh, let me see. I've got, this is from the 70s. It's a uh, Monte Alban Mezcal with a, I don't know if you can see it. Let me see. There is a worm in the bottom of it. It keeps sliding around. There it is. And then I've got a... This is a neat one. Hang on. A 40. I have two of these. They're, um... Crazy Horse. Uh, 40s. They were sued over these. Uh, turned into this big thing. Look at how chunky that shit is. Whew. Nasty. But, uh, I got those. I've got some Tom Collins drink mixer from the 50s. If you wanna take a look at that. This is Graf's Tom Collins sour drink mixer. Got it, I don't know. Here we go. From the 50s, I have some real gems in here. I have some stuff that uh, I don't think you could easily get that I haven't had a chance to drink. Like uh, this, it's from the Stevens Point Brewery. Uh, let me see if I get the light right. 1994 opening ceremony. Uh, it's a sealed beer from their first groundbreaking run. Uh, I mean, I have some wild, wild stuff in here. Trying to see, there's a, a pile of 70s and 50s and 60s beers back there. There's uh, more of them down here. I got a Crystal Pepsi from their second run. I've got four entire containers of the Stranger Thing new Cokes, because Coke sent me four of them when I paid for two. And uh, today's video is going to be, what year are you, my friend? Hmm. This is, uh... Shit, I'm not seeing a year. Um, hang on. Yeah, I don't, I don't see a year on it. I'm gonna jump cut and maybe I'll pick something else. All right, so I found it. You're not gonna be able to see it, but it's this little white line there on it. You can barely see it right, right there. Uh, it says 06 on it, so this beer beer. Must be an alcoholic. Uh, this Diet 7 Up is from uh, 06, so that makes it almost 14 years old, just outside of it. So 13 years. Ooh, it's got a nice fizz to it, I'll tell you what. It smells a little tinny. It smells a little really tinny. Uh, side note, I got this out of a house locally that they were selling things out of, and uh, it was in a man's house, and I found a bunch of pills in there, and he had apparently passed away. And the pills were labeled for infection. Uh, I sold a man two um, vault sodas on eBay that came from that same house. He's gonna die. This is the point there. All right. There's like absolutely zero flavor. It's got like a hard lemony after tinny aftertaste, but. There's no flavor, you know how like even diet soda has flavor? It tastes like like quinine. The like gross water they <laughs> mix drinks with. I 
Also, uh, good positive response to the Mothman series. Those are still going to be going up every Monday for, I think, about a month. Still got to edit a couple. But they're pretty cool. I, mean, I threw a coin into a dead bobcat's ass. And YouTube unmonetized that, then watched it, and remonetized it. Apparently, you can't barf and poop in your intro song because I can't use it anymore. I got to redo it. Uh, but you can throw quarters into dead bobcat's asses. Some Something's weird there. All right. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. There, Brianna and Gabe police. We're gonna go investigate. That's the investigation noise. Car, maybe? I think that's a car. All right, I'm gonna pull them out and save their lives. I'm like, you gotta, you get out of that car, you, you kids. It's a good amount. Of, oh my god! Oh, I thought that was this red car. Whoa! What is it? Definitely fire. I'm pretty sure that's a car. They're making everybody turn around. Look at these people. Are. Get as close as you can, Brianna. I am. I'm going to get up there. Is there cops? Yeah. Oh my god. I'm going up further. These people can suck a dick. Oh, he's dead too. We live out on Jerry's Road, remember? This is sheer insanity! It's carnage. Pretty intense. Oh my god. Yeah, I think I would move the fuck out of there. I'm about to do what they're doing. Okay. Get okay, as close as you can. Oh. Get back up. Holy shit. Yeah, I, I think I'm gonna get out and shoot it. Right here. Dude, new station will buy the footage. New station will buy the footage. Holy shit, dude. Wow, that's crazy. That's what we're doing. Suck a dick. Well, if we can get around him. This car is blocking it. Back up. There you go. Yeah. I'm trying! The fuck? I think I just didn't like that I was recording him. Now I'm going, all right, now I'm going back to the fire area, but without the police officer who's mad because I was recording. So, uh, I preface this with, I don't know if anybody died or not. I haven't checked the news. So if it's like horrible and terrible, I'm not trying to be morbid. Uh, you know, people die. That was a pretty, pretty intense fire. Let's have a look. Wait, there's no crime. It's not illegal to go look at shit. Ah, I almost fell in a fucking ditch. Look at this crazy shit. That was a hellacious car fire. Jesus. Wow, it's like steel or some kind of gelatinous, looks like chair cushion. So? It's crazy. Cameraman, thanks for gonna get mowed down.